This is how you draw and label a self-inflating bag in under two minutes. First, draw a circle, then draw a rectangle, then draw an open triangle. Connect the rectangle to the circle by drawing two smaller rectangles. Connect the circle to the open triangle by drawing a right angle. Now, oxygen will flow into one of the smaller rectangles. This will inflate the self-inflating bag as well as the reservoir bag. To prevent excessive pressures building up and potentially exploding the bags, you will need a pressure valve. During the squeezing of the bag to provide inspiration for the patient, you will need a one-way valve to prevent backspill into the reservoir bag. You will also need a pop-off valve to prevent excessive pressures being generated inside the patient. During expiration, you will need a duckbill mechanism or expiratory valve to prevent backspill of expired air into the self-inflating bag. You can also have a peep valve to provide positive and expiratory pressure to the patient. Now, for the self-inflating bag to reinflate, if there is inadequate oxygen flow, you will need an air inlet valve. And that is how you draw and label a self-inflating bag in under two minutes.